Anyways, what are we cooking today? I'm making something up. <laughs> Yellow. I bought it from the green market. I will put it into this Japanese, you know, roasted seaweed. So I clean and then I um, wrap it with a uh, paper towel. I'm going to split it in the middle. This knife is really sharp. Just be careful. Or you can put it on the board, you know. Right, split it into two. And then I'm going to wrap this. Like you can do it this way instead of using your hand like I did earlier. Okay. That's what I probably do. One portion of water and one portion of wasabi. It's about one, one teaspoon each. That is pretty much it. Even I usually use liquid amino, but this I think is worth it. Japanese soy sauce. The fancy soy sauce. But it's very tasty. This is about two to one. You can smell the difference, right? Yeah. It's oh, it's very burning my eyes. It is? Yeah. Oh my god. Talking about sensitive. Cannoli. I just gonna shallow fry it. I don't want to. Be Not safflower. Well, we go with Japanese today. I just want to make it crispy. That's why I'm frying it. I mean, you can literally just just eat it like this with the wasabi sauce. Okay. And I talked to my fish guy. Then I showed him something I made. He said, you didn't buy the scallop for me, right? I said, no. And he said, you know, but usually they, the frozen scallop, they have too much water content to do what I'm doing. I don't think it's going to splash too much because it's like it, the, the water, water in here is protected by the seaweed, you know? Pretty hot. I'm going to put it... A star in a sizzle. Yeah, and then I'm going to turn it upside down. And I'll put another one in here. Okay. Take it out, turn it off. Take really sharp knife. Yum. Sauce. Thank you. 